think we can finally catch our breath now. and I felt my blood power manifest in that battle. Thank you. I think a new blood bullet was formed in the process, too. Really? It is as I hypothesized. The presence of your resonance increases the chance for a mutation. Well, let's see. I can do episode next. So your god orc's not feeling right, huh? What now? They are like pets? Pets now? Yeah, ever since I switched up my grip. It's not just performance, the whole balance feels off. Alright. I think we can handle that. Long weapons like spears are generally front heavy. Plus, we have to set up a tuning regimen. But don't worry, I've got some ideas. We'll try a bunch of stuff out. Let's see. Tuning, tuning. Shift the center of gravity. Must adjust for blood art resistance. Expansion protocols and a whetstone. <laughs> Looks like we're going to need a whole bunch of materials to make this happen. Ah, I get you. That's, uh, that's real kind of you. Uh, I could really use your help on this. Oh yeah, because you cannot use it, right? You cannot use the god until you repel, right? Sweet. Decided. I'll get you a big old list of all the stuff we'll need. Got it. 
I guess we'll be sticking together until it's finished. I'm sorry to bug you with this. Wait, so what? Yeah, let me check. I wonder how many episodes they have. It appears that each blood bullet has a different and unique characteristic. Wait, is it the same cutting or is this different? For example, analysis of the second bullet shows a new trait called Pierce. Intriguing. Pierce allows a bullet to drive through an enemy instead of shattering on impact. Take a sniper rifle bullet for instance. It hits, activates its effect, then shatters. It is an exceptional tool on its own, but imagine if it had the piercing effect of laser fire. Ooh, lasers. Okay, that kind of sounds cool. Somehow, in all of the myriad natural reactions that occurred, this bullet was created that can do just that. Ah, so, so sorry. Basically, this bullet will pierce multiple targets, hitting each with explosive force. We might be able to make more like it. Bullets with effects that we couldn't have imagined. Hmm, that's a difficult question. I've made several so far. It'd be great to edit them. However, it seems that the modules themselves are fixed. I'm not sure it's even possible. The bonds are incredibly strong. I haven't found a way to dismantle them for editing. Lika said it was like looking at an unbreakable shield wall. Not those exact words. Fight fire with fire? What do you mean by that? Ah, the impact of one blood bullet against another! Can you wait here? I need to try this right now. I'll be back in just one moment. <sighs> well, that was fast. I... I did it! It sounded mad almost, but it worked. I placed the bullets downrange and fired free. Some of them were damaged, but... That was the key. The sheer impact of an unstoppable force and an immovable object created this. We can finally customize blood bullets. You're you're amazing. Wow, she she becomes friendly when he does. I really didn't saw this game to be so different that one. Uh, sorry, I was excited and got carried away. Thank you so much. I can hardly wait to begin new testing. I, I don't want to be a bother, but. Ooh, boy. I can't believe it. You have my eternal gratitude. I... I just... Thank you so much. You are cleared to engage. Operation commence. This battle begins and ends with me. I'm transmitting SHIELD's new intel on the enemy. The Link support device is now spreading its effect through the combat zone. Type's damage has been augmented.
down. Conditions have been fulfilled. Link support device is spinning up. You're at burst three. Wipe the enemies out. Aragami neutralized. Well done. I think we can finally catch our breath. Now. Blood Alpha. Burst time is ticking down. it recently but I'm always apologizing to you aren't I uh, I'm sorry oh <laughs> maybe maybe it started because I always feel like I'm imposing on you taking time but you spoke to me when I first joined blood long before I thought I would fit in and more than that, you risked your life, your freedom, your career, just on the hope of me. You awoke my blood power with your care, your kindness, simply by being who you are. And even then, you became my, my first ever friend. Yeah, friends. Sure. Maybe that's why I'm always apologizing, because you've done so much for me. Too long ago, I don't think I would have understood that. I wouldn't believe it. But now, we've spent so much time together. I think I know just how amazing those words are. Blood bullets are a technical marvel. They'll make our fighters better. They'll save lives. To truly understand the technology and share it with the world, I'll need help. And that's... that's why I want to keep researching this. That's why I hope you'll continue to help me. Will you? I thought you might say that. Thank you. You've done so much to make me who I am. I want to at least try to repay you. So, if you'll let me, if you want me to... Please, allow me to stay your friend, your best friend. Forever. Wait, now I can use it? gonna work on this now yeah some people can really do some amazing bullets even for just so but just for the soy I guess I'm okay with the, the one I have here hmm I guess this is supposed to be the next step
keep a weather eye on Moving on, our last operations have been successful. Moreover, we have not lost any training or operation Nana, time due to injury. To All of our Dr. god arcs remain at peak right? operating yeah, efficiency, so. and our kill counts our have grown dramatically. Miss Lika has requested that we make better use of our advanced teams. Reconnaissance and distant ranging missions are the team's <gasps> bread and butter, so to speak. Kibari also approached the captain and no. me with the same suggestion. It is safe to say Nana. that we will continue to hey, hear a good right? deal about this in the future. Nana! Come on, stay with me! Nana! What happened? So, how does it taste, Nana? Really good! It's the most delicious thing ever, Mommy! Wonderful! <laughs> when you're happy, Mommy's happy. Now, Mommy's going out for a while to slay the bad monsters. Will you keep your promise, Nana? Uh-huh! I won't cry, and I won't get mad, and if I'm lonely, I'll eat an Odin sandwich. You're such a good girl. Remember to be careful, and I'll be back in no time flat. That's my promise. I will! <gasps> oh, Vice Captain, you're... and she'll... I... I collapsed. Didn't I? Hmm. I had a really awful dream. Everything was dark, but I could feel blood and... It's all right. Perhaps you should lie down a while longer. Yeah? Okay. Thank you, Sheil. That does feel better. I bet you didn't know Dr. Rachel took me in after my mom died, huh? I was still really little when it happened. It feels like I've forgotten so much. I think for a long time it was just mom and me. I must have lived up near the mountains, I guess, because I do remember it snowed lots. She was a god-eater, too, so when she left to go fight Aragami, she'd always make me promise. I'd smile and say that I wouldn't cry, and I wouldn't get mad. And if I ever felt lonely, I'd have a super delicious Odin sandwich. When my tummy was full with my mom's cooking, I wouldn't feel so alone anymore. <laughs> and she always smiled really big when I ate a lot. <laughs> That's why Odin sandwiches make me so happy. They always remind me of being with my mommy. And of the promise I'd make to her. Yes! I feel better! <sighs> well, that was quick like and coming. Run! Or go eat an entire giant sandwich on my own. <laughs> but, oh, more important, thank you for listening to me. Please do be careful, Nana. Perhaps you should go visit Dr. Rachel for a quick checkup, just in case. Ma'am, yes, ma'am. I'll go see her as soon as I've had just a little snack. Promise. <sighs> okay, can you stop? Here I come. Oh, boy. I can already see it. YouTube is not gonna like this. <laughs>